851, turn right, heading 180. Hey everyone, I'd like to welcome you back, or either to DJ's Aviation. With half the world heading into a very cold winter and snow already falling in the likes of New York, I thought I'd take the time now to discuss the impact that snow has on the aviation industry with focuses on people and also aircraft. Usually my introduction to videos can be lengthy, but I'll jump straight into this one with a look at how it affects aircraft. Snow, while it does look amazing, it can impact flights and aircraft more than you potentially could imagine. While us as passengers sit inside the warmth of the terminal, the aircraft and also the incredible ground crew team fight the cold and de-ice the aircraft as well as prepare it for flight. Essentially, if snow is to fall on the aircraft, it can freeze parts of that plane. In turn, if it is left unattended, it can drastically impact not only the aircraft's systems, but also the way it then operates. If the aircraft does make it into the sky, there is the risk that something still could go wrong. This is why hours are spent into turning around the aircraft, de-icing it, checking the weather conditions, and more. Similar to fog, snow can also result in visibility being poor from the pilot's angle. With this visibility being poor, it makes it harder to fly safely. While often pilots do encounter poor visibility, they don't usually have to do it through a snowstorm. Flights are also impacted by the snow collecting on taxiways and also the runway. This can result in the ploughing of the runway to remove the snow and have a safe departure. However, even after that ploughing, the runway still can be icy and slippery. Therefore, it can be less than ideal grip-wise for aircraft to depart and land. All this in turn can force an airport to close a runway. This diverts aircraft in the air and delays departures. This has a knock-on effect then which results in chaos that you see at airports during this festive and holiday season. Ultimately, a bit of snow may not affect your flight too drastically, but a blizzard will definitely shut down the airport and leave you at the airport or diverting to another location. Seeming we're discussing snow right now, I thought I'd take the time to briefly mention de-icing and what its purpose is. You heard me bring it up earlier, but the process of de-icing an aircraft is very important and critical to getting an aircraft not only on the runway for departure, but also in the air. De-icing is the process where snow, frost, or even ice is removed from aircraft. It's one of the most incredible sights to see in the aviation industry. A chemical is essentially applied, known as anti-icing, although I'm sure there is a more sophisticated and technical name, and that chemical is put on the aircraft to delay the reformation of snow or ice on that said aircraft. This is often done just before an aircraft departs, and hence why you'll see de-icing trucks in various in-flight videos when the passengers have already boarded. Speaking of passengers, how does snow impact them? It can impact travellers in various different ways, but ultimately the worst impact is flight cancellations. Often these are the most common outcome. Flights are cancelled because airports and also airlines deem it to be unsafe to continue regular operations. This in turn can throw out passengers' plans, whether that be because they have a connecting flight or have a meeting for work. However, while in the heat of the moment tensions can run high, it is always ultimately the correct decision. Unfortunately, sometimes safety can result in sacrifices. While travellers face delays, tensions in the terminal can cause to overcramming, and before airports know it, there are thousands of people waiting and asking about the situation. In addition, people in the air during a snowstorm or blizzard can be diverted to other airports. Sometimes this can be a close one or one that is hours away from their target destination. If the weather does clear, similar to the passengers wanting to depart, they can either be bussed down to their destination or put up in hotels to wait for a new flight when the weather has cleared at their end destination. While snow can certainly look beautiful, it ultimately impacts the aviation industry greatly, and similar to winds, it can cause delays, cancellations, and more. I'd like to wish you all watching this a very happy and also a safe holiday season. I'd also like to thank you very much for tuning into this video of mine. If you did enjoy it, feel free to drop the video a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new. I do very much look forward to you all joining me in the next one.